unpaid medical debt in Wisconsin is now $1.4 billion. The Wisconsin Hospital Association has released its updated uncompensated care report. It uses data from 2023. And they said uncompensated care is $1.4 billion for 2023, up from $1.28 billion in 2022. Uncompensated care is a combination of bad debt and charity care expenses. In that number of $1.4 billion, just over $730 million is bad debt, while just under $630 million is attributed to charity care expenses. On the screen, we're showing the trend of uncompensated care over time, and it's steadily creeping up with some little fluctuation during the COVID pandemic. The increase in uncompensated care in 2023 is likely linked to the end of continuous Medicaid eligibility for folks in the process called Medicaid unwinding. Wisconsin redetermined Medicaid eligibility for its 1.4 million Medicaid enrollees, and they kept about a million people enrolled, but about 400,000 were terminated. Bad debt for Wisconsin hospitals increased by almost 2.8% over the last year report, and bad debt is up over 5% since pre-pandemic 2019. On the charity care side, charity care services provided increased 6% over 2022, which is a good trend, but it's still lower than pre-pandemic 2019. In fact, when compared to 2019, hospital charity care dollars have dropped by almost $13 million. We're keeping an eye on that charity care number because there's an exchange that happens here. Most of the hospitals in Wisconsin are nonprofit hospitals. They get tax breaks and tax exempt status in exchange for providing community benefit. And charity care is a big part of that community benefit. Are they helping the lowest income patients that they serve? According to that Wisconsin Hospital Association report, charity care for all reporting hospitals only average 0.7% of gross patient revenues. Keep in mind the national average is 2.3%. Wisconsin families are still facing a huge burden of medical debt. Some hospitals are still engaging in aggressive collections actions, credit reporting of debt, and even denied care. In a statement, Bobby Peterson, executive director of ABC for Health, said medical debt is a public health crisis that is ready for bipartisan community and legislative solutions. And he said most hospitals can do so much more to proactively help patients and communities. They need engaged, knowledgeable patients assistance staff that understand system barriers and can help patients prevent or avoid certain debt. You can read that Wisconsin Hospital Association Uncompensated Care Report and ABC for Health's press release. We link to it in the description below.